Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Panzer General 2, the Russian campaign. This is the third scenario. Let's take a look at the core forces. We lost the artillery unit in the previous scenario. Now I was under the, in the, under the impression that we also lost our prototype anti-tank unit, the Yusuf Stalin one five two but it's still here so that's good news we did lose a bomber two bombers left decent amount of prestige but we definitely need to buy a fighter maybe two fighters And I think it is maybe a decent idea to do some overstrengthening. Also, the briefing mentions the importance of paratroopers. We could maybe. Promote these regulars to paratroopers. Let's do that for two units. Let's get a fighter. And let's overstrength. Thanks. Also want to overstrength the bombers. They'll need those. Well, I think we will probably need another fighter. So let's give the units some um, experience. These guys will need it. They will face tigers and panthers. Basically anything the Germans can put on the battlefield will be superior to anything we have. The best tank we have is still a KV2, which is not great, and best fighter is a Yak 9, and it will also be shot out of the air in no time by a Messerschmitt or a Fokker Wolf or whatever we will face. I'll save the remaining prestige. Let's take a look at the map. So we have a lot of a lot of little villages. Large river swamp. This looks like an alternative route. Ending in a choke point near a bridge over the Dnieper River. But I think I'll ignore this part of the map and just break through here and then start traveling southeast towards Mesrich. We have a few auxiliary units, no aircraft though. Bridging, bridging. Three, three bridging units, that's very helpful. Now we will ignore this part of the map. 
do have a few regulars, auxiliary regulars and a artillery piece. Right now our Russian army doesn't have any artillery at all. Scout. Let's see, this is rough, but after that we can travel over the road, so it may be helpful to spread out the army a bit. Troopers, I think these guys. Yes. We only have one fighter. So that may be a problem. Another tank here can use the bridging unit. Well, maybe one because after crossing the river, the tank will have to navigate forest and rough terrain. This is all clear, that's good. So we can get some more tanks here. And here. Lastly, the infantry. That's it for deployment. Let's go. Start scouting ahead. Might as well take the villagers. These guys will have to wait. Cavalry. We can scout ahead a bit. Same goes for these auxiliary forces, we will keep them in this area, they provide a target and can keep the Germans busy. Another bomber here. Cannot reach the Yak 9. So I think I'll keep it where it is. 
Well, we can actually get another fighter already. All right, let's do that and. Use it for scouting, maybe. Let's also keep an eye on the number of bombs. Are there any additional airfields on the map? Well, not close by, so. Serving bombs may be a good plan. But destroying the enemy is also a good plan, so let's go. Cannot even kill a garrison. <laughs> it's kind of disappointing. They will have to wait on the river bank. Bridging units. These bridging units are not necessary anymore, so retreat to the village. What about the paratroopers? We can maybe get them airborne. At least one of them. Let's keep the others in reserve for now. And that's it for the first turn of the KNF scenario in September 1943. Eight turns remain, that is. will be difficult, I guess. And there's the Luftwaffe. And the Panzers, this is a 4H, I think, and we have reinforcements. Paratroopers, so those are the actual paratroopers from the briefing, I suppose. Doesn't seem to be anything here. Thank you very much. They can stay in this area. Nothing here. Nothing here. All right. Let's get out of the rough terrain. Still rough. Cavalry across the river. And uh, what can we do? German scouts, but they can prove to be very difficult. We noticed that in the Blitzkrieg campaign, four bombs remain. Now the tanks are obviously a priority target, so well, let's go. Uh, protect it. Mm. 
if we do that we will leave the paratroopers and Fokker Wolf, yeah that will completely annihilate our air force so that will be a problem Yeah, two destroyed. Pitching units are not needed anymore, they can keep the victory objective. Let's just keep scouting ahead. And maybe... How much prestige? Wow, that's a lot. Let's get a fighter immediately. I'm afraid we will lose some of these to the Fokker Wolf. Absolutely no match against those. And let's travel further south with the paratroopers. This is a ME-110. Let's get another fighter. And get the paratroopers airborne. Decent range, right? Let's go. The map. So we are ignoring this part of the map. to avoid this one which will be difficult we will definitely lose some airplanes it would be helpful if we... well, this is probably the only airfield available. Well, it's hard to see. It would be very helpful if we can take this ASAP. And I think that is it. Well, these guys can scout south a bit more. Bridging units are not needed anymore. Can rest in the village. So 
seven turns remain. So we got a strength two Panzer four. And, the, and a Tiger inbound. field here. It's too far away, we can never capture that. Tank disappeared. There was another tank here. Keep scouting. Bound. Let's move our bomber. Land the paratroopers on the bridge. Actually, try to take the airfield with the paratroopers. Let's send the rest of the Air Force Force East. Away from the Fokker Wolf. But let's see what's in this city. For regulars. Yeah, that wasn't smart. Well, zero destroyed, zero suppressed. Keep moving south. Take a few villagers, maybe. 
for the prestige. Bridging can retreat. This will get destroyed by the tiger. Could maybe lure, lure the tiger north. Away from Kanef, possibly. Yeah, we may need a decent unit in the city. Let's maybe get a KV2. Place the bridging engineers. Well, stay in the victory objective for now. Uh, that's it for the turn. Six turns remain. Tiger indeed traveling north. Wow, <laughs> that's insane. One of the major anti-tank units, a T-34 against a German scout, but they are unable to destroy it. Paratroopers can take the city. Can land the other paratroopers on the airfield. Kill off the ME 110, maybe. Some new bombs. Scout ahead.
Pioniera. I think we're already done with the turn. Yeah, I'll keep these units here to eventually, hopefully, kill this scout. Regulars. Maybe take this. And keep moving. Keep retreating north. Luring the tiger, hopefully. We can stay in the village. Well, take this village. Two ammo left. Can get another fighter. Another target for the Fokker Wolf. And a Airborne scout. That's it for the turn. Five remain. Right supporting artillery right there. And the tiger keeps traveling north. Very good. Well, we get a lot of reinforcements apparently from the west in this area. Can we maybe destroy the scout? Thank you very much. Regulars cannot reach the village. These guys need to... Well, I could give them replacements, but there are multiple units in this area. Let's move it out of the way and hope for the best. Take this village. Send in the scout. Start bombing. Regulars, regulars, alright. These guys may be in trouble here. So let's send one bomber here. Take the bridge. Keep the airfield. The wall supporting artillery somewhere around here. Let's scout it out.
That's insane. This is a 12 strength T34 against a 7 strength Stook. Completely surrounded too. Moving and these guys can hopefully keep the objectives. Keep retreating north. it for the turn. Check the map. A few turns remain. Three, four, all right. Yep. Well, that's pretty uh, dangerous. Bad news. Wow. I think we nearly lost a fighter. And we have maybe have a problem here. Can get a bomber. And a Yak 7 will have to do. Cannot even destroy that. Something like that. Regulars. Probably take the city and maybe keep the tanks moving, maybe send this tank back to support here. First up though. Panther A and H23. Yeah, we definitely want to do something here. 
We will lose this fighter though. Not much we can do about that. These guys need supplies. And maybe an additional target here. On the bridge. Just to block access to the victory objective. Another four J, another version of the four. Send this tank towards. Oh, we can also send the paratroopers, maybe, towards this city. Sounds like a good plan. need support here so spread out the tanks a bit try to block the bridge Still have a fighter. These guys need replacements. I think that is it. Well, no. These guys still on their mission to keep the tiger away from. Is it Kanef? And they did a good job so far. Try to get this bridge. We may have an issue here. 
cannot get other troops. So the bomber and the fighter and the bridging unit will have to do. Forces are a bit spread thin right now. And we lost a scout. We lose a fighter. That seems like the Germans get a lot of reinforcements. We have another bomber here. Could send it towards Kanef. That is disappointing. <laughs> Even lost one. These guys need to assault. for those troops occupy the bridge replacements for you Guys, Let's not land the paratroopers right now, that would be suicide.
And I think that is actually... It for this turn. Two turns remain. Tiger is now retreating back to Kanes, and we lost a core unit there. Excellent. Keep the objective. can land the paratroopers in the city. Very good. But cannot end the turn. Not sure what happened there, but... Well, that's... Disappointing. I guess I'll have to try that again. Not sure. Probably a bug. Alright, well, that's it for this episode. <laughs> we did achieve a Bruins victory, but it didn't register, so we will try this again. For now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.